So here we go. Moment of truth. <laughs> Let's have it. Je vais à France. Greetings, folks. It's your mate Ray once again. This is my second time out of the country, and you're invited. Let's go. Let's go. So yeah, usually I get the train to King's Cross, 9 times out of 10, 10 times out of 10, but this time, purely by accident, I got the train from Sheffield to St Pancras, and that's where I had to leave from, obviously, to get to France, but I still went to King's Cross anyway. The ticket from Sheffield to London cost me £20, and the Eurostar from London to Lille cost me £63. Chilling here, there's a latte place. They're giving out lattes for free, which is rare. It's North London. Cool artwork. <laughs> Houston Road. So yeah, I remember staying up there with a woman called Jenny, uh, who was Kanye West UK promoter at one point, before even anybody had heard of Kanye West. Um, Jenny was promoting his work out here. Now he really hates Kanye West. Ain't it funny, like that's like 20 odd years ago. I mean like, what the Do you know King's Cross has changed? It's changed. There used to be, you come down here and it'd literally be like, you'd see a pimp and you'd see like eight, 10 girls walking behind him, all doled up. My would be at the front, all like rude boy limp and that. They're like what? Like, you know, it was a real eye opener back in the day. Just down there. Cali Road is that? Yeah, just down there. You just go down the back there, there'll be people like sitting there with no shoes and socks on, just rocking backwards and forwards, like tough. And um, yeah, it was mad. Dealer on every corner. Yeah, so just killed a bit of time. In all honesty, not really doing much other than that. 
and then we'll be off to France before long. A couple of hours, and I'll be in France. Checking in. We're checking in, bro. And we're 15 minutes early. Queues in here, I'm mad. J'arrive. Je vais à Lille. <rire> voilà. So that wasn't too bad at all. Quick journey, do you know what I mean? Smash down there. Is that dawn from something? The end of day one um, good day tomorrow we're gonna to go exploring the local area and we will go and get some food morning I slept like a log in the end I woke up late for my breakfast <laughs> 
Yeah, I woke up at 10.30 and there was like a woman trying to get in my room. And then she got in my room. Man. Very different really, isn't it? The house is roof shapes and... Are they houses? Are they apartments? Is this roof patio safe to walk on? Probably not. I'm going to take a walk um, and I'm going to get some breakfast. Just kill some time, see some sights before 3 p.m. where I have to check into my next hotel. Um, nice big double bed this time. Why did I book two hotels? I don't know. Just because the other was nearer to uh, to the bus stop in the morning when I travelled to Shevinenyen. 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 Regarde, les poissons. This is one for my conspiracy friends because this building right here was built by master freemasons in the 1600s so those guys will love this or not it's the former gate to the city it was renovated in the 1800s and when leo got the city of culture in 2004 i believe it was renovated again but in all honesty if you really want to enjoy this place i'll give you fair warning make sure that you hold your nose before you walk through the arches because it smells like piss and bitter memories. Thinking about it, it probably didn't smell too dissimilar back in the day. It actually does smell like it's been 400 years of people urinating in the same spot. So if you want to get the full experience, don't hold your nose, but don't say I didn't warn you though. Actually, this is what I was looking for. A nice park. Damn, these walls are old, man. Some old city walls. <laughs> I mean, that's basically where we've got to go, over there. Sixteen twenty-one. Wowzers. As soon as we're here, I might as well tell you as well that Lille is actually one of the cheapest cities in Europe that you can visit right now in 2024. So if I was you, and if you was on a budget, I'd come to a place like Lille. And if, like me, you like staying up all night looking at crime statistics, then you will know that Lille is also in the top 10 for the most crime-ridden cities in France. But I didn't see any of that. It was a great experience, and the French people were absolutely lovely. In fact, it was only me who was committing crime there by smoking in the park. So, here in a French park on a chilled Sunday morning, I had updated my room to find out that I'd already had got the best room. Uh, so the upgrade was literally just for the breakfast and I missed the breakfast. <laughs> anyway, I'm hungry and let's go get something to eat. Let's get a drink, let's get a coffee. François Mitterrand. Bonjour François. Ça va? It is flipping hot. It's wham.
best burger I've had in my uh, burger career, but uh, I enjoyed it nonetheless, you know what I mean? I needed something to eat, I had an espresso, and I had myself a pint as well, delicious. I watched the world go by for a little while and uh, brushed up on my friends. You know, you should really just make the effort anyway, you know, when in Rome or when in France. Uh, but it is a Sunday, so it's quiet and uh, that's my kind of day. I need to check in in half an hour's time to my other hotel. It is the Hotel Lille Europe, which, um, hotel. And yeah, no, it should be all right. I've got a double bed this time and I'm really, I'm just going to get some footage of this place and I'm going to go and chill. Actually, I'm going to have a... Now I'm no stranger to Lille, this particular area of northern France. I like it. I've only heard shit music so far, you know, the, the psychopathic drill stuff and that, like, the ego rap. I'm um, this and I'm um, that, I got this and got that, I got, I make this and make that, you know what I mean? I wear this and wear that, it's like, f off, bruv. The amount of ego juice dripping out of you is disgusting. Clean yourself up, lad. So there's me checked into my second hotel. I made some music. I looked at my atlas for a while and I had an early night. Initially, it was just supposed to be a segue. Now, I really enjoyed being in France because the people were so hospitable and nice. Uh, yeah, I hope to be back because I didn't see as much of it as I'd like to. But like I said, it was only supposed to be really just passing through and I want to see more. Good morning, folks. I'm here in Lille still. I'm about to hit the second leg of my journey and head to The Hague in the Netherlands. So my bus is due at 10.20, got a little bit of a wait, so I'm going to smoke a joint.